All right, so get this. Okay, imagine, just imagine, having an AI assistant and this AI assistant can whip up a whole documentary for you. Wow. Just like that. Yeah. Or even one that could like remix, totally remix, classic, you know, classic literature on the fly. Wow. Like that's the kind of cool stuff that we are diving into today. I love it. AI powered educational resources. Yeah. And we're not talking, you know, like sci-fi fantasies here. No. You're talking practical tools that you can use like right now. Absolutely. It's incredible to see how quickly this whole field is evolving. Right. You know, we're moving beyond just like digitized textbooks now. Totally. AI is opening these doors to truly personalized and engaging learning experiences. It's amazing. Exactly. And our guide for this deep dive is a presentation by Roger Ray. And this guy, he's clearly passionate about this stuff. Yeah. Even a quick glance at his slides, I was hooked. Really? He's walking us through building everything from these documentaries to a personalized Don Quixote audiobook. Wow, how cool is that? I know, right? Imagine an AI Don Quixote audiobook. They can dream up new adventures for Don Quixote. It really makes you think about how we engage with information in a whole new way, you know? Yeah. Imagine a student and they're struggling with a dense history chapter instead yeah. of just like rereading the same text again and again. Right. They could just ask their AI to create, I don't know, like a timeline, generate a map, or even like summarize the key points in a different way. You know, that's powerful stuff. Totally. Okay, so let's break down how this all works. Yeah, let's do it. Roger's presentation actually starts with this step-by-step -step guide to building a documentary entirely with AI tools. Nice. Slide three, it lays out the entire process, and it's surprisingly straightforward. Okay. You start with brainstorming and co-creating your script with ChatGPT. Right. Which is like having a brainstorming partner, like, on demand, you know? It is. It's like having a co-writer, like, right there with you who's always generating new ideas and helping you refine your vision. Right. It's incredible. Then you can bring your script to life with AI narration using Eleven Labs. Oh, cool. Imagine having access to different voices and accents to make your content more engaging and relatable. For sure. For Especially sure. for diverse learners. And not just voices, but emotions, too. Oh, wow. Imagine selecting the tone and the delivery style that best suits the content. Right. Whether it's an exciting, you know, historical narrative. Yeah. Or a calming meditation guide, the possibilities are endless. Absolutely. And of course, no documentary is complete without visuals. Of course not. That's where tools like Kling AI, PixFirst, DAL3, and Hedra come in. Wow, that's a lot. I know, right? These AI powerhouses let you create everything from realistic images mm -hmm. to like abstract art, yeah. all based on your prompts. That's amazing. It's like having a team of digital artists yeah. at your fingertips, just ready to bring your vision to life. It really democratizes the whole creative process, doesn't it? I'm totally... You no longer need expensive software or like specialized skills to generate really high quality visuals. It's amazing. Yeah, it's incredible. Yeah. And for like, you know those background melodies and sound effects that really set the mood? Oh yeah. There's SU. Yeah, it's amazing to think you can now find the perfect soundtrack for any learning experience. I know. Even generating, like, original music tailored to your needs. It's like having a custom soundtrack. I love it. For your lessons. It's incredible. And finally, finally, you can pull it all together with Microsoft ClipChamp. Okay. Which is a, like, user-friendly video editing tool. Right. That makes polishing your masterpiece of breeze. So cool. What's remarkable is how this entire workflow really empowers educators Probably. to tailor content to their students' unique learning styles. Absolutely. Imagine creating a documentary about ancient Rome. Oh, wow. Complete with dramatic reenactments and maps and even a musical score. Oh, my goodness. Talk about bringing history uh, to life. Right? I know, right? But you know me, I'm always drawn to the more unexpected applications of AI. Okay, yeah. Like, what happens when you fuse this technology with classic literature. Okay, interesting. That's where Roger's Don Quixote example right. on slide five really blew me away. Really? He created this custom AI audiobook that goes way beyond wow. just reading the text aloud. So it's about transforming a passive listening experience yeah. 
into an interactive exploration. Exactly. I love that. Imagine, imagine listening to Don Quixote uh -huh. and being able to like ask for a deeper dive into a particular character's backstory. Oh, wow. Or even requesting a visual representation of a scene. That's incredible. It's like having the book come to life right there in front of you, allowing oh, no. you to explore all the nuances of the story and the characters in a whole new dimension. And get this, you can ask the AI to generate new adventures for Don Quixote what? and Sancho Panza, or even introduce new characters into the mix. Oh my goodness. It's like having a writing partner who can tap into the style and tone right. of a literary masterpiece. It challenges our traditional notions of authorship. Totally. And opens up all these exciting possibilities for creative exploration. It's like having a portal. I love it. To infinite possibilities within a story. That's amazing. And speaking of possibilities, Roger's presentation also dives into AI tools that are designed specifically for educators. Okay, great. Slide seven showcases EduActivity. Okay. Which is like having a virtual teaching system. Right. <laughs> at your beck and call, you know. Right. Imagine needing a quick and engaging activity for your students on, I don't know, like the solar system. Okay. Instead of spending hours scouring the internet. Right. And like cobbling something together. Yeah. You could simply tell EduActivity what you need. That would be amazing. I know, right? It streamlines the whole lesson planning process, totally. freeing up so much time for educators. That's incredible. To focus on what really matters, connecting with their students and fostering that love of learning. Absolutely. You can choose from various activity types. Okay. Like crosswords, flashcards, or even interactive games. Oh, wow. You feed it the information that you want to cover and boom. Yeah. It's your activity generates the activity for you, ready to share with your students. That's amazing. And you can customize it further, right? Yes. Tailoring right. it to different learning styles and levels. Absolutely. Yeah. It's about empowering educators with tools that enhance their creativity. Yes. And their effectiveness in the classroom. Exactly. But AI's role in education goes beyond just content creation. Okay. It can also help us automate yeah. those tedious administrative tasks. Oh, I know. Tell me about it. That can really bog us down. Oh. The word. On slides eight and nine, okay. Roger introduces the dynamic duo okay. of ChatGPT okay. and Google Apps Script. It's a powerful combination, isn't it? I know, right? ChatGPT, with its natural language processing capabilities, yeah. can be used to actually generate code what? for Google Apps Script, which automates tasks within the Google Workspace environment. That's incredible. Oh, it sounds complicated. I know, but it's not. But Roger actually walks us through an example mm. of how to use these tools to automatically create folders and documents. Oh, wow. With generated names. No more spending hours manually creating and labeling digital files. I know, right? That's incredible. Imagine the possibilities. I know, it's amazing. You could even automate tasks like sending personalized feedback to students. Right or grading multiple choice quizzes. It's a game changer. And if you're wondering just how far you can take this automation magic, uh. Roger's got you covered. Slide 10, it showcases how to generate personalized certificates from data in a spreadsheet using ChatGPT. Wow, really? I know, it's amazing. That's amazing. It's incredible to think you can automate something like that with just a few well-crafted prompts. It highlights the importance of like, clear communication with AI, you yeah. know, by providing specific instructions, we can guide it to produce really highly tailored outputs right. for a wide range of educational purposes. Absolutely. It's like having a personalized like certificate printing machine right. at your fingertips. Wow. But that's just the tip of the iceberg. Okay. Roger's presentation is packed with even more examples of how AI is transforming education. What else? What else? On slides 11 through 13, he delves into some really, truly eye-opening applications. Okay. 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 What's fascinating is how AI can be used not just for creating content, but also for enhancing the learning process itself. Absolutely. Imagine using AI to generate, like, real-time translations during a lesson. Oh, wow. It could break down language barriers and make global resources accessible to all students. That's incredible. I know, right? It could be transformative for language learning allowing students to interact with authentic materials and practice their skills in a more immersive way. For sure. It's like having a universal translator right there in the classroom. Right. And for those beta-heavy subjects, well, yeah. imagine leveraging AI for on-the-fly calculations and data visualization. Okay. 
Right. Yeah. It could make complex concepts way more tangible and easier to grasp, allowing students to explore relationships and patterns in a more interactive way. It's about bringing data to life. I believe. And making it relevant to students' lives. Absolutely. I love it. And let's not forget about those interactive elements that can make learning so much more engaging. Yes. Interactive quizzes, right. for example, can provide instant feedback. Yes. And help students identify areas where they need further practice. It's like having a personalized tutor who can adapt to each student's pace and learning style. Absolutely. And for those tech-savvy educators and students out there, okay. Roger introduces us to WebSim.ai on slides 14 and 15. Okay. 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 WebSim.ai is a fascinating platform that leverages AI for various tasks. Like what? From real-time translation yeah. to image generation. Oh, wow. It's about simplifying complex processes and making them accessible to a wider audience. I love that. It's incredible how easy it is to use. Okay. Eat quick translation. Yeah. Just type in your text and WebSim.ai will provide an accurate translation in seconds. Wow, that's incredible. It opens up a world of possibilities for cross-cultural collaboration and communication. I love it. And if you need a visual to accompany your lesson, WebSim.ai's image generation capabilities are truly impressive. Wow. You can create custom images based on your prompts without needing any design experience. So cool. It's another example of how AI is democratizing content creation. Right. Empowering educators and students to bring their ideas to life in these visually compelling ways. Totally. It's like having a magic wand oh. that transforms your words into images. That's incredible. And while we're on the topic of innovation, okay. Roger also gives a nod to Claude.ai on slide 16. Claude.ai. Claude.ai is known for its collaborative features. Okay. Particularly its ability to handle what they call artifacts. Artifacts, what are those? These artifacts could be anything from text documents to code snippets. Okay. And Claude.ai allows users to work on them together in real time. Wow, that's really cool. It sounds like an incredibly powerful tool for group projects and collaborative learning. Totally. And with that, we've reached the end of our deep dive into Roger Way's insightful presentation on AI-powered educational resources. It's clear that we're just scratching the surface of what's possible with AI in education. Absolutely. As these tools continue to evolve, we can expect to see even more innovative applications right. that transform the way we learn and teach. It's an exciting time to be involved in education. And if you're eager to learn more about Roger's work yeah, and connect with him directly, be sure to check out his contact information on slide 17. Awesome. It's been great, you know, diving into this presentation. It has. It's been really eye-opening. Thank you for having me. It's been a pleasure. And for our listeners, until next time, keep exploring, keep learning, and keep asking those big questions. Thanks.